As we wrap up what's expected to be the hottest July on record, lots of us seeking some relief on the water. GMA helping you stay safe this morning following a number of recent boating incidents. ABC's Alex Perche is in Westerville, Ohio with more. Alex, good morning. Good morning, Wit. Yeah, tens of millions of Americans go boating every year. And when the weather's gorgeous like this, these waterways are even more crowded, which is why it's so important to have a safety plan in place on the water. This morning, dramatic video of a water rescue in Michigan. It's too late. Get off the boat. Get off the boat. It's going to blow. Two people stuck on board this 21 foot Baja as it goes up in flames on West Grand Traverse Bay. You guys want to jump out right jump now? Jump out right now. As the fire intensifies, the pair forced to make a dire decision jump overboard. I knew very quickly that if they did not get off the boat, they were either going to pass out from the inhalation of the smoke, the heat, or it would end up eventually exploding. They were lucky Nathan Greenwood and his wife were boating nearby and able to come to the rescue. It's really fortunate because within three seconds of them jumping off of the boat, it, it exploded. That fire engulfed the boat, soon sinking it to the bottom of the bay. What happened in Michigan echoing some of the other recent trouble on the water this summer? Last week, 17-year-old Sadie Morrow was killed off Cape Cod. The boat she was in hit a jetty, sending her and five others into the water. And on Friday, one woman died and six people were injured when a boat crashed into a break wall and overturned near Chicago's Navy Pier. That crash happening around 3.30 in the morning. Anybody operating a boat, you need to know your navigational hazards, know your capabilities, make sure you have life preservers on board for everybody. According to the Coast Guard, 74% of deaths on vessels happen when the operator hasn't received boat safety instruction. And now this billion dollar boating business means more crowded waterways this summer. An estimated 100 million Americans go boating each year. And in 2021, an estimated 1.15 million pre-owned boats were sold in the U.S. There's you know, way more people on the water. People need to take this more seriously and get some more training, get some more instruction. And states have different requirements for operating a boat on the water, but most offer a certificate kind of like a driver's license. But experts stress it's important to practice, to have that safety plan in place, and definitely have enough life jackets on board. Wait, gotta have that plan, Alex. Thank you so much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.